Sometimes in Blender, we like to have the interface clean, or we like to show some features and hide another. And we do this process every time that we restart the program. So today I'm going to show you how to save this preference. For example, one thing that I always do is to go to geometry nodes and start closing this and hiding this. So instead of doing this every time, what you can do, for example, is to do a copy of these windows with right click and select duplicate. And now we are going to customize this window. First of all, I'm going to change the name and I'm going to call it tutorials because I always record tutorials. So in this window, I don't want to show this window. So I'm going to close it. I want, for example, to hide this panel. Also, I don't want to show the 3D cursor. So I go here and select disable 3D cursor. Also, I don't want to show this. Most of the time, I never use it. So let's go here and select text info. So now I have the window clean to do tutorials. So to save this window, what I have to do is to go to File, Default, Save a Startup File, and now select Save. So now this window has been saved every time that I'm going to open Blender, and I'm going to show it to you. I'm going to close it. And now I just open Blender again. You can see with this screen. And look at this. I have this window already saved and it's showing the first one. If you don't want to have this one or the new one that you're going to create the first to show, just select the default window and save it. So if you save it like that, don't worry, you will have this window first. But here you are going to have your own window. So now instead of going every time to geometry nodes, and do all this process to hide all this, I just go here and I have this window ready for the next tutorial. So if you work in Blender and you like to have your own interface, I recommend you to do this process. If you like this video, give a like, subscribe, and see you in the next video.